Aluminium sulfate, Wikipedia article audio. Aluminium sulfate is a chemical compound with the formula Al23. It is soluble in water and is mainly used as a coagulating agent in the purification of drinking water and wastewater treatment plants, and also in paper manufacturing. The anhydrous form occurs naturally as a rare mineral milosivicite, found e.g. in volcanic environments and on burning coal mining waste dumps. Aluminium sulfate is rarely, if ever, encountered as the anhydrous salt. It forms a number of different hydrates, of which the hexade cohydrate Al2316H2O and octade cohydrate Al2318H2O are the most common. The heptade cohydrate, whose formula can be written as 6235H2O, occurs naturally as the mineral alanogen. Production in the laboratory, aluminium sulfate is sometimes called alum or papermaker's alum in certain industries. However, the name alum is more commonly and properly used for any double sulfate salt with the generic formula XL, 212H, 2O, where X is a monovalent cation such as potassium or ammonium. Aluminium sulfate may be made by adding aluminium hydroxide, Al3, to sulfuric acid, H2SO4. Or by heating aluminum metal in a sulfuric acid solution. The alum schists employed in the manufacture of aluminium sulfate are mixtures of iron pyrite, aluminium silicate and various bituminous substances, and are found in Upper Bavaria. Bohemia, Belgium, and Scotland. These are either roasted or exposed to the weathering action of the air. In the roasting process, sulfuric acid is formed and acts on the clay to form aluminium sulfate, a similar condition of affairs being produced during weathering. The mass is now systematically extracted with water and a solution of aluminium sulfate of specific gravity 1.16 is prepared. This solution is allowed to stand for some time, and is then evaporated until ferrous sulfate crystallizes on cooling, it is then drawn off and evaporated until it attains a specific gravity of 1.40. It is now allowed to stand for some time, and decanted from any sediment. In the preparation of aluminum sulfate from clays or from bauxite, the material is gently calcined, then mixed with sulfuric acid and heated gradually to boiling, it is allowed to stand for some time, the clear solution drawn off. From alum schists When cryolite is used as the ore, it is mixed with calcium carbonate and heated. By this means, Sodium aluminate is formed, it is then extracted with water and precipitated either by sodium bicarbonate or by passing a current of carbon dioxide through the solution. The precipitate is then dissolved in sulfuric acid. Aluminium sulfate is used in water purification and as a mordant in dyeing and printing textiles. In water purification, it causes suspended impurities to coagulate into larger particles and then settle to the bottom of the container more easily. This process is called coagulation or flocculation. Research suggests that in Australia, aluminium sulfate used this way in drinking water treatment is the primary source of hydrogen sulfide gas in sanitary sewer systems. An improper and excess application incident in 1988 polluted the water supply of Camelford in Cornwall. From clays or bauxite When dissolved in a large amount of neutral or slightly alkaline water, aluminium sulfate produces a gelatinous precipitate of aluminium hydroxide, Al3. In dyeing and printing cloth, the gelatinous precipitate helps the dye adhere to the clothing fibers by rendering the pigment insoluble. 
Aluminium sulfate is sometimes used to reduce the pH of garden soil, as it hydrolyzes to form the aluminium hydroxide precipitate in a dilute sulfuric acid solution. An example of what changing the pH level of soil can do to plants is visible when looking at hydrangea macrophylla. The gardener can add aluminium sulfate to the soil to reduce the pH which in turn will result in the flowers of the hydrangea turning a different color. The aluminium is what makes the flowers blue, at a higher pH, the aluminium is not available to the plant. In the construction industry, it is used as waterproofing agent and accelerator in concrete. Another use is a foaming agent in fire-fighting foam. From cryolite It can also be very effective as a molluscicide, killing Spanish slugs. Uses Mordant's aluminium triacetate and aluminium sulfacetate can be prepared from aluminium sulfate, the product formed being determined by the amount of lead acetate used. Chemical reactions The compound decomposes to gamma alumina and sulfur trioxide when heated between 580 and 900 degrees Celsius. It combines with water forming hydrated salts of various compositions. Aluminium sulfate reacts with sodium bicarbonate to which foam stabilizer has been added, producing carbon dioxide for fire extinguishing foams. The carbon dioxide is trapped by the foam stabilizer and creates a thick foam which will float on top of hydrocarbon fuels and seal off access to atmospheric oxygen, smothering the fire. Chemical foam was unsuitable for use on polar solvents such as alcohol, as the fuel would mix with and break down the foam blanket. The carbon dioxide generated also served to propel the foam out of the container be it a portable fire extinguisher or fixed installation using hose lines. Chemical foam is considered obsolete in the United States and has been replaced by synthetic mechanical foams, such as AFFF which have a longer shelf life, are more effective, and more versatile, although some countries such as Japan and India continue to use it. Footnotes Notations